Alright, so we're going to practice, uh, let's do 10 down cuts. So we're going to do five on each side. And then we're going to do 10 up cuts, five on each side. To that uh, double front jump kick. Yes, sir. Okay. Pitch stance. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three. Four, five, six, we'll do that one count. Pull back for seven, dab for eight, and we're doing our retreat for nine, and then double front jump kick. Ten. Okay, um, those last seven <laughs> were new for the last class, um, yes, so this is kind of a review for those last seven. Yes, sir. Oh, uh, we're six. Yes. We stopped, we had stopped at the monkey hop symbol because I knew the monkey hop was going to move. Usually, it takes like an entire class to learn the monkey hop. Um, everybody in class learned it pretty quickly, um, so we kind of moved on. If you're still having trouble with the monkey hop at home, um, continue to practice it after class. Please, please, please continue to practice it after class. So, okay. Let's reset. Yes, sir. Tension stance. Sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, up, pull back for seven. Step for eight, or retreat for nine, and then double front jump kick. Do this one more time. I'm going to move down just a little bit. Yes, sir. Just so that um, when we get that move, I'm on camera. Okay. Stand, stand. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Whew. Okay, get ready for this next one. This one's hard. That's <laughs> it. Um, all we're going to do is turn around. Right? Okay. So, turn around. It's easy. <laughs> turn around is not easy. So, left hand is the chamber. Saber is going to be on your left shoulder. What we're going to do is that left leg that's up, it's going to come down, and we're going to throw it around us. Okay? So, it's going to start. Start here, and then we're going to throw it around us. And if you have to do a little bit of a hop, a micro micro hop, in order to get this, then you, you'll have to do a micro hop. Okay, so it's just a little bit of a hop as that leg comes around. Okay, especially if you're on a surface that's really sticky. So, okay. so it's a 180. So it is a 180. You're going to do the question was it's a 180? Is it a 180? Yes, it's a 180. Um, and then what we're going to wind up doing is we're going to be in the exact same position, but we're facing in the opposite direction. Sir. Um, and this is going to test your balance. Sir. I'm not joking on that one. Okay, so um, for the next two minutes, I'm going to have everybody practice that. Okay, I want you to kind of get used to doing that move. Um, just kind of throwing that leg all the way around. Just coming right back up.
It's like my body wants to keep rotating more. It does. <laughs> That's going to be kind of one of those hard things. Is figuring out, so the question, the comment was, uh, uh, Mr. Nelson's body wants to keep rotating. So this is this is kind of one of those things. We, we practice this quite a bit. We, we saw this with our southern leg with the ground rotation. Um, a lot of times <laughs> when you do the ground part, uh, you're going to wind up spinning more than you need to. And same thing here. It's it's just kind of one of those things where you just need to figure out how to control it a little bit. And it just takes a lot of practice. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, all right. That was about two minutes. Let's take a look at the next move. The next move is just a repeat. Um, it's a double front jump chain. So let's start uh, facing at the end of 10, and then we're gonna do our next move. That's where we do our 180. And we're gonna step forward into a double front jump kick. This is the same exact double front jump kick we did in the opposite direction. Now we're doing it in this direction. Yes, sir. Okay. learn two moves. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this uh, the next move is a lot harder. So we're gonna we're gonna practice this one a couple times. We're gonna start here. We just finished that first double front jump kick. We're gonna turn around, double front jump. Whew. Okay, let's make it a little harder. We're going to face the original way. We're gonna do our first double front jump kick. We're gonna hold our position. And then we're gonna do our 180. Do our second double. <laughs> Not that easy, is it? No, sir. Okay, so uh, I'm going to have you guys do that for about two minutes. Sir. Um, I really want to do this next move. So, um, that's only two moves. We just learned two moves. This is, these two moves are hard. Yes, sir. <laughs> um, it, uh, just, there's a whole lot in Kung Fu where it's just like, it looks easy. You see people do it. It's like, oh, just kick, turn, kick. Uh, once you actually do it, your body's actually pretty heavy. Uh, <laughs> the, the muscles that are actually doing all the work are very big and they need a lot of oxygen. <laughs> um, so, uh, a lot of these moves get to be tiring pretty quickly. So, if you need to take a short break, take a short break at any point in time that we're doing this. Um, but we're going to move on. We're going to learn the next move. The next move is pretty easy, but it requires a lot of space. If you don't have the space at home, don't take as big of a stride on this next bit. So the next part that we're going to do is after that front kick, um, we're going to set that right foot down and we're going to skip one, two, three. And this, you'll notice that this travels a long way. Yes, sir. The, the point here is that we're trying to cover a long distance. Like this was a battlefield, we're trying to cover a long distance. Um, we're, we're probably covering about 10 to 15 feet. Yes, sir. Or about three to five meters if you're. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, we, should, we, should, we should get. I don't know what the education system is like today. <laughs> but uh, you're going about 10 to 15 feet. Um, it's it's quite a ways when you're when you're doing it. And a lot of times when you see us do this, we'll actually wind up going almost all the way across the room or halfway across the room. That's a long way. So if you don't have that much room in your house, uh, the best way to practice this is just little teeny tiny steps. Okay? Yes, this next part is gonna be very difficult to do if you're at home, um, especially if you have a full size saber. And that is we're about to do what's referred to as a decapitation technique. So here's the, I'm going to kind of do a quick demonstration on this one, and that is where we, we do our double jump kick. We're going to go one, two, three. Um, I'm going to have my arms kind of together and across. I'm going to do my monkey hop, and as I do, this is going to come straight up. This is going to be about neck level when I do the cut, and I do a turn. So the, the turn and the cut 
are going to happen at the same time. So as we open our arms and we, we, and we do that turn, that's when the cut happens. Okay? And then it's going to end up right behind our back. So when we do this, this jump, it's going to wind up being a 180 degree turn. So we're going to skip one, two, three, open up, jump. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> now, I, I apologize. It's not usually what we do is we, we have everybody line up on one side of the room, but we, we kind of have some social distancing issues in the in the school right now, which makes this a little difficult. Um, if you have a yard at home, this is great to practice. If you have uh, if you have access to a park, um, this is also a good place to practice. Okay. So uh, that is all the time we have for today. Uh, if you can uh, remember all the moves that we just did, um, let's do this. Before we bow out, let's run all the way up to all the new stuff. So we're going to put in those, it's just three moves, <laughs> but we're going to practice the whole thing with those three brand new moves. Yes, sir. Okay. Can you stand? Sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pull back for seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Stances correct. Um, that's enough for you guys to actually practice. It's going to give you 25 moves. That's a lot. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's a significant amount. Um, so I want to say we're going to run about 60 ish moves in this form before we're going to get to the middle point. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, the, the one right before we end is hard. Yes, sir. All right. Okay. <laughs> Just preparing everybody for that. Okay. Let's go. Yes, sir. Bow to head instructor. Bow to your little students and everybody at home. All right. Master pack training dismissed.